little bit about the, the antimicrobial? So we have the world's first antimicrobial cover glass. It's based on ionic silver that's embedded into the glass to last through the lifetime of the device. So basically you will have a glass that will be antimicrobial through your C device, right? And the way it's, we do it is by embedding ionic silver. Okay, and ionic silver is a well-known antimicrobial agent. Right. And what we've done is we've controlled the amount of silver that we've put into the glass, such that all of the gorilla glass properties, the optical properties, the mechanical properties, the dielectric properties, all of those are changed. So antimicrobial gorilla glass does not look at all different from gorilla glass. Right. Okay? It's also the first EPA registered cover glass and to sell an EPA uh, to sell an antimicrobial product you actually need registration with the EPA all right so that's what we have so we can sell that okay and what we have is uh, here is a, is, a, is a demo for a, a room wizard it's the first product that will have antimicrobial cover glass it's this room scheduling device okay, and should be out sometime uh, in the middle of the before the middle of the year okay, okay? so probably sometime in Q2 or so uh, Q2 Q3 yeah but Q2 I think by Q2 it should be there Sure. What happens if you put silver into soda lime glass? What you get is yellowing. Okay. What happens if you get antimicrobial film laminated on gorilla glass? The film scratches. We know that plastic films scratch. That's why gorilla glass is such a is, is so popular Absolutely. on right. And if you look at the gorilla glass and the antimicrobial gorilla glass, there's no difference. It looks exactly the same. Right. Okay. That's what we have. If you want to volunteer your phone, we can yeah, uh, swab your phone and see what kind of a reading we get, okay? Sure and we'll, we'll, uh, there's, a, there's a chart out there and we'll uh, show you where you uh, show up. Absolutely. High, medium, or low, okay? Sure. All right? It's just a cotton tip with water, mm -hmm. so it's absolutely harmless. And we just try to pick up whatever you got. That's all we're trying to do here. Right, that's it. We put this back. We snap the bulb here that releases the reagent mm -hmm. and the reagent reacts with whatever contamination you have okay. and you get some light that we will read using that meter. And then we can compare it with the... And we'll see where you, where you show up. Sure. Okay. Countdown begins. We'll find out. <laughs> so it really only it, it only takes about fifteen seconds. Or fifteen so. seconds or That's so. But awesome. you got to measure. You're not you're not just measuring bacteria. You're measuring organic contamination. Right. Right. Which may be bacteria. And if you get a high reading, you'd have if you had antimicrobial gorilla glass, you'd be able to say, well, bacteria are getting reduced. Right. Right. That's the whole idea. Oh, you are. Eight or nine. Oh, ouch. I'm, so that's where. That's where you are. <laughs> yeah, I'm not uh, not doing too good with that. <laughs> Most people are in the moderate levels. Yeah, you're a little high. Yeah. But it's nothing to worry about, I guess. For you know, we cannot, we don't recommend you make any changes, right? Right. But you would have been feeling a lot better had this happened on uh, an antimicrobial cover glass because then you could say that the bacteria are getting reduced. Right. Right. So that's the point. My other question really is, is I, I've seen a lot of people talking about, you know, ever since this was shown off at, uh, here, I've seen some people talking about uh, concerns about, you know, th this kind of thing possibly developing more resistant bacteria that'll just, you know, be resistant to, to this technology. So that's a good question. I'll attack it from, from two directions, right? The first, first is, all we're doing here is we're keeping the surface of the glass clean. That's all we're right. doing, clean of bacteria, right? That's all we're doing. This is not about antibacterial soap that's got tons right. of right. antibacterial agents so that it cleans your hand every time, right? Right. Now, why do we need it? We spend about an hour each day on our smartphones, the same amount of time we do eating and drinking. Sure. Right? Now, can you think of what other thing do we have in our lives that we spend an hour on and never clean? Pretty much anything we use, really. I mean, laptops, tablets. Um. But do we touch, right? Your keyboards. Yeah. Right? All of those things that we spend hours on and do not clean are sources of contamination. Sure. And that's what we're trying to do with a cover glass. With a cover glass, we bring it very intimate contact with. We touch it. Right. It touches our face. Right. Things that we do with our smartphone a little different from what you would do, right? With a keyboard. 
just yeah. to play in keyboard, right? So that's 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 the need. And the second question about you know what's different? Well, silver has been an antibacterial agent for thousands of years. It's known and its activity has not diminished. And that is why we think that silver in general, unlike antibiotics, do not necessarily breed okay. resistant strains because it interacts with bacteria in a variety of ways, yeah. right? I'm not an expert on the science, right? But what we can say is the fact that silver has been an effective antibacterial agent for thousands of years suggests that right? silver would be a good uh, antibacterial agent to use for an application such as this. Right? Absolutely. And again, keep in mind that all we're doing here is putting just the amount of silver to keep that surface clean of bacteria, right? right? You're not trying to, it's not spitting out antibacterial <laughs> agents, right? right. That's, that's, that's a significant distinction from the other antibacterial products that you hear about. Right? So it's very different. Right. Okay? All right, well, thank you very much for your time. Right. Thank you. Take care. You too. Yeah.